when should we be expecting to see the newly acquired Ben Simmons to make a third? Yeah, Greeny, there's tremendous urgency around the Nets to get Ben Simmons on the court, get him incorporated and playing with this team. Now, the Nets start a three-game road trip today against the Celtics. Simmons is going to join them at some point, and the Nets' hope is when, bought, when Brooklyn gets back after Thursday's game in Philly, uh, that Simmons at that point will be ready to start getting on the floor with his teammates and increasing his workload, getting closer to returning. That back problem uh, has been an issue for him since he's tried to start ramping up. He's essentially really just done individual work at their facility. They're hoping by the end of next week, the end of this week, he'll be able to do more. But no chance he plays Thursday night There in is Philly. no chance he is playing in Philly Fair Thursday enough. That's the game a lot of people wanted to see. In the meantime, just having KD and Kyrie together has been a relatively uncommon occurrence. It's happened just 39 out of the 224 games the Nets have played over the three seasons these two have theoretically been together, including just three times this year. That's just 17% of Nets games with both of these stars in uniform. And so, Stephen A., let's get into it here. You just heard the latest on when we could expect Simmons. What is this team going to be the rest of the way? I have no idea. Mm. I would love to be able to tell you since I predicted that the Brooklyn Nets would be in the NBA Finals. I'm so utterly disgusted with this team. They make me sick. You got Ben Simmons up in here. He's in there. He, his mind is not right. And so he can't, you know, he can't play. But he could travel with the team. He could be dressed. He could be on the sidelines cheerleading. He could be like, let's go, let's go, let's go. We got Kyrie Irving with eight games left. You only available for seven because you unvaccinated. Look, man, I'm mad at Kevin Durant because I'm saying, how much more of this are you going to accept with a smile on your face? as the playoffs come up, uh, closing upon us. I mean, my God. I mean, can we just have a, the, the, think about what we're asking here, y'all. We're asking for the team to show up and be a team. That's what we ask it. We ain't asking you to drop 120 points a game. We ain't asking you to hold the team to 90. We ain't asking you to win 60 games. We, we're literally asking dudes get paid over 30 million a year. We're asking them to show up to show the hell up. I'm sorry for using that word on a Sunday morning, but I'm so disgusted because I just want to see elite players play. Even if you ain't elite, just show up and play. And we're sitting here having this conversation about the Brooklyn Nets, who's going to play. That's why I say I don't know, because I don't know who's going to play. By the way, they're healthy, and I don't know who's going to play. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. <laughs> it's hard to argue with anything he said. I mean, I mean I, the way he says it sometimes, the reality of it is everything he said is right, and I think a lot of basketball fans feel that way. The question is, when it's all said and done, is this a team that is still going to make a deep run through the Eastern Conference playoffs? A deep run for them means they got to be in the Eastern Conference Finals. I, don't, I can't take them seriously yet. I just don't. They're, they're, they're an afterthought to me at this point. If they go out and beat, the Celtics today yeah. have been the hottest team in the East other than well, even hotter than Philly. Then, okay, maybe I'll feel differently about it. But I can't take them seriously. And, no, I don't take them Deep run for them as they're constructed is supposed to mean conference finals or finals. I, I don't see that happening. I don't see them being good enough. Not uh, Maybe so, Jalen so, talked okay. me out so, of this. So I'm going to graduate my Lakers take with the Nets. If the Nets get healthy and Ben Simmons is in the lineup, the top of the East is in trouble. That's my expectation, and here's why. Imagine if we get a Nets in the Sixers series in the playoffs. I can't definitively say that Philadelphia would win. The depth that they now have in the backcourt with Kyrie to go with Seth Curry is going to be terrific. It's going to be very tough to stop. Kevin Durant, even though he's missed so many games, that's less wear and tear on his body. So he's going to be a lot fresher. Greeny, I'm telling you. If Here's ben, the problem. If they can get anything from Ben Simmons, anything. That's a big Will if. they be able to get anything from Ben Simmons in Philly? I mean, here we are. We, no. We, have, we are, many of us believe that he Good is point. doing everything he can to avoid playing this regular season game there, which would mean his first game back there would be in that playoff series. How would that go, Stephen A.? It would be very, very bad for him we because it. if it's a, if it's – a mental issue as it pertains to the Philadelphia 76ers fan base. Mm -hmm. As a guy that was a, a reporter and columnist in Philadelphia for the Philadelphia Inquirer for 17 years, I can assure you as much as my skin is black, 
as much as I'm sitting here, my man with a receding hairline, <laughs> I can guarantee you that moment when that brother shows up in Philadelphia, they will be waiting for him because they know in their mind they can get to him. And because they know he can, they can get to him, and now that he's a part of the opposition, they are going to eat him for breakfast. But see, the thing is, his role is different now. He's not the second fiddle. I agree. He's the third fiddle. And he don't have to give them skill. He just got to give them will. He got to play defense, right. run the floor, I and agree. let KD, Kyrie, and Mill shoot it every time. Time out, time out. Well, yeah. He knows that. He knows that. Nash knows that. You know, Sean Marks knows that. Kevin Durant knows that. Everybody knows that. So why the hell ain't he playing? Well, this it, is it, what it's bad about. Here's, here's the issue. We're talking about how's he going to perform against Philly. We're talking. Wolves just said he's ramping up yeah. to get to practice. He's not oh, practice right. to quote another great <laughs> Philadelphian. Yeah. Practice. Not he ain't even practicing yet. I mean, so so this this team is going to get hot enough to to Allen enter Iverson. the playoffs in top four. Allen There's Iverson. no way. Allen Iverson is rolling over in his bed right now, sitting yeah. up there. Practice. I can't believe that this is happening. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.